Lately, it's been sellers um, not being really sellers. Yeah. Uh, you know, not that. Uh, so the wire fraud is usually the buyer side or an agent even sometimes will have their emails compromised. Right. And so when we send an email and we're asking for payoff information or let's say we get a payoff, legitimate payoff with wire instructions to, let's say, Wells Fargo. And so someone will want to see that payoff and we'll send it to them. Well, when we do that, if they're compromised, a fraudster will grab the email, delete it, but in the meantime, have re-edited the payoff to show a different set of wiring instructions and turn around and send it to us. Mm. At which point I'm like, okay, we wouldn't know because it would seem like Wells Fargo is sending the same thing, but with a different wiring instructions. But instead of Wells Fargo, it says another Wells Fargo account or Bank of America or something. Hard to catch. And so what we do is we put in place something called certified ID, which I'm giving them a commercial. But so every payoff that comes through, no matter if we get four payoffs on a file, we'll verify it through certified ID. And certified will tell you if the bank account matches that uh, payoff. 